Hello everyone, my name is Brittany Morris. I'm a project manager here at Stormwind Studios. I'm here to talk about one of my favorite subjects, file management. Currently in our office, we're using SharePoint Online and it's a really great resource for uh, document sharing. However, it can be tedious to use it in the browser. If you have used it before, moving files around definitely takes a lot of clicks. So I would like to show you an easier way to manage your files within SharePoint Online using File Explorer. So we're gonna move over to Internet Explorer 11 or whatever Internet Explorer you have. I'm working within Internet Explorer 11. I have it open here. I also have my SharePoint open for you to see as well. So what you're gonna do, most of the time you're gonna see uh, when you do uh, copy and paste your link into the search bar, you'll see a pop-up that asks you if you wanna trust this site. You wanna click on yes, you wanna trust this site so since I've already been working within the SharePoint in Internet Explorer, it is trusted. So I'm gonna show you what you're gonna do if that pop-up doesn't appear or if you have clicked on it before and you wanna check. What you're gonna do is go to your toolbar on the top right-hand corner. You're gonna click on Internet Explorer, Internet Options, you're gonna click on Internet Options. Once you're in Internet Options, you're gonna to go to your security section it's gonna automatically highlight trusted sites. That's what you want. You're gonna click on sites. Uh, so what you do here is just click and paste your SharePoint site into this uh, bar. Mine is already added. Uh, one important thing to note here though is when you do open up this window, it will have a preset check mark here where it says require. It does have a check mark here where it says require server verification. You want to uncheck that because it will not allow the website to appear in your drive. So once you have clicked that, you click add. Mine is already trusted. You're going to close this window and you should be good to go. So we're going to go back to your file explorer or you're going to open your file explorer. You're going to click on this PC. You're gonna click on computer, map network drive, and then you're gonna click on map network drive again. So you're gonna choose uh, where you would like your SharePoint link to live. I'm gonna choose Y because why not? And then I'm gonna paste my link into the folder area and finish. So once you finish, you'll see that your uh, SharePoint site link will appear under this PC. And then to the right, you'll see every single document library that you have within your SharePoint. What's really awesome about this is you can click on a folder, you can uh, save multiple versions of something within here, and it will sync to your SharePoint online site. Everyone on your team will be able to see those files and you get to move things around very quickly and it should save you a lot of time. So I hope that this was very helpful for you. Thank you so much.